Governor Matawale said over 80% of people in the state are farmers, which informed his administration's decision to accord priority to agriculture in order to boost food sufficiency. He disclosed that the state government had procured 3,000 metric tons of assorted fertilizer to be distributed to over 2,000 registered farmer associations at a subsidized rate. The farmers who go and meet the problem of their total loan requirement and cutting the remaining balances after the request. Sadly or not, however, the government has been finding it extremely difficult to retrieve the funds to ensure any general farmers. This program has been impending the government's effort to provide the farmers with much needed water and other farm implements. To address this issue, the government did it most appropriate to send the farmer the Pokalava on a current and current basis that are clear to the world's work to conduct our expectations of the farmer with all products, with the current initiative and feeling for us to maximize the existence. The governor assured residents of the state of his administration's efforts to combat insecurity and restore peace so that everyone can go about carrying out their businesses without fear of terror. With this initiative, I want to assure all our assembly that the government will continue to do everything possible. The spirit of life and property of the citizens everywhere in the state. The special advisor to the Zamfara State Governor on Comprehensive Agriculture Revolution Program applauded the state government, saying that such programs can improve food security. It only has marked the beginning of the sale of fertilizer on cash and carry basis to our team and farmers at subsidiary rates, according to said, as you will hear from His Excellency, the Executive Governor. However, this objective could not be achieved without the continuous support and prompt attention According to us by the present administration of Ghana, Bella Mohammed Matua Nomaradu, who is all out to see the successful implementation of all our programs based on the fact that they have direct bearing to the team of farmers, thereby enhancing food security in our beloved state. Furthermore, the state government said it will introduce irrigation farming, where the government will rent out farmlands to civil servants and farmers alike. This will assist in creating revenue for the state and also improve food sufficiency.